specifics here. There was a recent comparison that Phil Jackson made between J.R. Smith and Dennis Rodman. I agree. You see that? I totally In which agree. Ways? Well, I think J.R. Smith is one of the most talented players in the league. Whether or not he decides to live up to that talent is, is uh, on him. But I think the wild card factor of Dennis, obviously the tattoos, there's a sort of, you know, detachment. You know, Dennis, you couldn't really read what was going on with him and J.R. Smith. And I think he's an X factor. I think that J.R. Smith is the X factor to these current Knicks because, uh, to this team, because Carmelo is going to buy in. Carmelo plays hard. You could be frustrated with the ball movement or lack of ball movement, but Carmelo Anthony every night, he played the most minutes in the league last year. He bangs, he goes hard. It, J.R. Smith is, if he gets back to being the sixth man of the year, J.R. Smith, the Knicks are a, a whole different team. You know, it's like five or six wins he can get you, you know, just, just on his performance. So I understand that the, the comparison. And I think that Dennis Rodman is, and, and Ron Artest uh, uh, were way more far out than J.R. Smith. And, and you know, uh, Phil Jackson got them to buy into a system. If only every year could be a contract year, Michael. Then we could get that That's five right. to six That's wins. Right. Did you see that? Wait, was the six man of the year a contract year? Oh, you know it. It's, oh that's too predictable, my friend. Oh, my God.